Where'd all my hair go? Where's my beard? I look different, don't I? Better? No? Okay, well, I tried. Welcome to my discography of one of my favorite bands of all time, Led Zeppelin. They are definitely in my top ten of my favorite bands, but these are the only albums that I have by them. I don't have everything, but I have heard everything by them. I just don't have all of their albums. But the ones that I do have include the very first album that I ever heard by Led Zeppelin. When I heard it, it was on vinyl. So it was way better than this copy that I have on CD. But it's their debut album, Led Zeppelin. One of the best albums of all time. My favorite song on this is Babe, I'm Gonna Leave You. So a lot of really great songs on this. And next up, a lot of fans consider this to be their very best album, Led Zeppelin II. <laughs> their sequel, in a way. And my favorite song on this is the Lemon Song. Although, Whole Lot of Love is a very close second. Next up, Led Zeppelin III. Not one of my favorites, but still a great album. And my favorite song on it is Since I've Been Loving You. Next up, my favorite Led Zeppelin album, Led Zeppelin 4, or as some fans call it, Zoso, from the Symbols. A very amazing album, and it's kind of hard to pick my favorite song, but if I had a gun to my head, I would probably have to pick Rock and Roll. Although Stairway to Heaven is a very close second. One of the best double albums of all time. Physical Graffiti, amazing album. My favorite song on it is In My Time of Dying. Although I really like Cashmere, very close second. Definitely one of the best double albums ever. So that does it for the studio albums. Now going on to the live albums that I have. Led Zeppelin Live at the BBC, a two disc album from the 60s. Very, very good. They do a cool version of uh, I Can't Quit You, Babe. Or Baby, sorry. I Can't Quit You, Baby. There's a lot of good songs on it. Next up is when the song, well, the song remains the same. Sorry. The two-disc extended edition. Remastered the soundtrack from their movie of them live at Madison Square Garden. Very, very good. And I think I like this version of rock and roll better than the actual studio version. Next up, another live album, How the West Was Won. It's pretty good, but it's not as good as the song remains the same. It's kind of just like repeating the same thing, kind of. Although there are some songs on it that aren't on the song remains the same. And their latest live album that they did when they had a little reunion with Jason Bonham, John Bonham's son, Celebration Day. And this includes the DVD of the performance The CD just fell out. How do you like that? I'll have to pick that up. I don't know how that happened. And last but not least, I have the two-disc Greatest Hits album, Mothership, which includes a DVD. Excellent, excellent album. There's the boys, Robert Plant, John Bonham, John Paul Jones, and what's his name? Jimmy Page. 
Sorry. I knew his name. I was just being a smartass. Not like when I forgot Randy Meisner in my Eagles discography. So, that concludes all of my albums by Led Zeppelin. And I would love to hear what your favorite Led Zeppelin album is. So leave a comment below and please remember to like this video. Alright, and I will see you next time.